Good morning, staff and students. Today is Monday. It is March 26th. It's an A day, and as always, I hope the lines are ready to roar. At Howard High School, we are filling our days with pride because we are Howard Strong. We've got a short week here. It is four days. That's right, four magical days here before spring break. It's not the days that are magical. It's you that's going to bring the magic because you're going to make these four days the best four days that we've had so far this year. We've got a lot of important things happening in your classes, teachers doing things with quizzes, tests, projects we can do, all that kind of stuff. It's only about six weeks away from AP exams, so a lot of important things happening. You need to just stay focused, stay on point these next four days. We've got prom coming up on Friday, April 20th. And I don't need to remind some folks there that a 30-day exclusion from extracurricular activities, which comes along with a drug and alcohol violation, is going to be what gets you out of prom. So we do not want you missing prom there. So make sure that you are making good decisions today, tomorrow, throughout the week, and all throughout the rest of the year. So make good decisions and have a great week. Good, Good morning, morning Howard. Howard. How was your weekend, Amara? It was so great. It was. I slept a lot, like a lot, a lot. That's How nice. was yours? I, I didn't. I just had practice, and then it was Sunday, and here we are. <laughs> so let's uh, get to these announcements. But first, please, please stand, stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. There will be an interest meeting after school on Wednesday, April 4th in room A215. Anyone interested in playing JV or varsity boys soccer for the fall of 2018 season should try to attend. The meeting for the new intern mentor student schedule for Mar March 29th is canceled and will be held on May 10th. Please check your email accounts for details. Come out Wednesday, March 28th in the cafeteria at 2.30 for the GSA Spring Egg Painting. Come paint wooden eggs, eat food, and watch Rise of the Guardians. Admissions is $3, and we hope to see you there. The Tea Club will hold its March meeting this Wednesday in B121. The theme is Spice Teas. This month we'll be hosting an ugly mug contest, and anyone who is welcome to compete those wishing to compete should bring the ugliest mug or teacup they can find. Be prepared to vote on the ugliest mug. The winner will receive a gift card and... Why me? I don't know what that word is. <laughs> Just skip over it. Cause Some word of tea snobs everywhere. Spice up your life this month with good friends, tea and fun. Do you feel that there is a political bias in your, cla in your classrooms? Do you feel that your voice is being ignored or silenced? Are you frustrated with the current state of the government? Yes. If you answered yes to any of these questions, please join us at the first meeting of the Howard Republicans. Our interest meeting is April 12th. Look for more announcements after spring break. I love this. I don't. ASVAB testing March 29th at 7.30 a.m. in the auditorium. ASVAB stands for Armed Services vocational there you go aptitude battery the armed services ASVAP is a multi-aptitude battery test it consists of 10 short individual tests covering world knowledge paragraph comprehension arithmetic reasoning mathematics knowledge general science auto and shop information numerical operations coding speech not only will you receive scores on each individual test you will also receive composite scores Composite scores are a result of several individual tests combined to yield three academic scores, verbal, math, and uh, academic ability. Who takes the ASVAB? The test is offered to any junior or senior who is considering a military career. However, the test is also an excellent career interest inventory for all students. Prom guest forms are now available in the front office or on the Howard High School website. Guest forms must be submitted no later than Tuesday, April 10th. All students are invited to join the English Honor Society after school on March 27th in B113 as we host a Q&A session with an English major. Find out all about the expectations of college level English from a Howard alum and publishing young author. All are welcome. Do you want artwork displayed in a couple to a couple thousand people every single day for a year? Submit a cover design for the next school year's agenda book. 
You can either drop it off. You can either drop off your artwork in the front office or email it to Mr. Sackett. The due date for submissions is March 29th. Do you need service hours? Are you interested in helping others? If so, come to the UNICEF club meetings on Thursday at 2.15 in Student Services. We're looking for new members to join in our cause of bringing awareness and financial support to worldwide and local issues. Yes. Come join the Fellowship of Christian Athletes for Prayer and Fellowship every Wednesday from 2.15 to 2.30 in B123. You don't have to be an athlete to participate. See Mrs. Lawrence or Mrs. Reese if you have any questions. Yes. Well, that's all we have for you today, Howard. Good luck to all those spring sports out there with their first game, even though it feels like it's still winter, to be honest. It's cold. Yeah. So uh, have <laughs> a motivated, motivated Monday. Monday.